Hello my dudes, Crusader Kings 3 has come out with a ruler designer through which you can create your own custom character and I've decided that we're going to do that. In fact, there's something that we can only do with access to a custom character and that is have all of the children, just all of them. And, of course, we'll make him 120, thereabouts. Do you know what? He doesn't need any of these stat things. Oh, that's not where his priorities lie. They lie with having many, many children. And I guess we'll make them all sons. 47. We can have 47 sons. Give them a different complexion. Because yes, that's a thing you can do. You have all these sliders for ears even. Yeah, we'll give them ears. Ears of unusual size. But now that we've created this 120 year old king of France with gigantic ears and 47 sons. Let's see what happens in his life. First thing, we want to get him married. We're looking for someone who has the lustful trait and is of childbearing age. So we can hopefully pop out a few kids before we die. Because I'm pretty sure we're going to die like immediately. So even one kid is probably... Yeah, now we got the trait whole of body. So that's good. We are now married. To a 25 year old. As you can see, we've got the 47 children here. Most of them are actually quite old. Because we are, of course, 120. See, the oldest is 104. You're not long for this world, my dude. Did any of them get the ears? Yes, he inherited the ears. It's good to see that they'll live on, mostly. You can be married to this nine-year-old. Not weird at all. I don't know what you mean by that. You get married to a 16-year-old. You, with the ears, get married to this princess of Hungary. This is going to take a minute to get through all 47 of them. Yeah, we'll just get them all married off to random women. See how big we can grow the dynasty in a single generation. Oh my god, so many pop-ups. Look at all those alliances too. I think we named some of our kids some of the same names. Which... Seems a little... You know... Rude. Just look at them all. I'm just gonna fast forward it till we die. Well, already we're having kids, or our son's having kids. And another one had a kid. Oh no, our kid died. Well, it was only a matter of time considering they were all in their hundreds. We are 130 you now. Still outliving children. Yeah, these three who were 96, 95, and 98. Look, there's 94 that died. That's impressive you stash and our, our house worked their salvation through the lands. Oh, that could be taken in so many ways. Well, they're dropping like flies. Oh, and we finally have a son of our own. It's Prince Adalbert. 
Grow strong and wise, Adelbert. Yeah, we need to start getting the suns in quicker, my queen. To replace the ones that are dropping like flies. No, oh, the death spam is even worse than the marriage spam. We are getting so much stress from all these kids dying. Yeah, we're almost, we're at, <laughs> we're at stress three of three and it's giving us a severe penalty to our health. We're still alive though at 134, so. You went over your stress limit and reset to stress level three. That's, that's what happens? Oh wow, look at how many death slots we have. Okay, Sinchul, you're the oldest, so. Invite you to court. Grant titles. Grant titles. Oh. Aldebert died. And our son did too. Like as soon- oh my gosh, they are all dead. Look at that. We only have one living son. Okay. Congratulations, you get a barony. Two-year-old. I will be dead within a year. This is you, though you don't always feel like yourself. Well, that's an interesting one. Oh. Then we are now King Aldebar. But what I want to see is how many kids our dynasty managed to get out in that time. It actually didn't seem like that many. Yeah, 30 living members, so we actually lost members. Net. Because they were all so old. Because we were all so old. Well, I think that's enough for that particular little experiment. We learned that having a bunch of kids, or at least creating them through the ruler designer, by making yourself a very old ruler, and, you know, having the maximum number of kids actually doesn't really help spread your dynasty. Like, it, it helps, but not as much as you would think. Because some of the sons didn't even get out a single kid before they died. In fact, I would say probably most of them didn't. Oh, this guy... Outlived his... No, he didn't. He drunk himself to death. At age 114. Interesting. Yeah, so this experiment wasn't the grand success I hoped it would be. But it was interesting, and with the ruler designer experiments like this are, you know, in large supply. So we may be looking at some more in the next few weeks. In any case, remember to like if you liked and subscribe for more Crusader Kings 3. Thanks for watching and goodbye.